Hello and welcome to the vlog. I am stopping 62nd September just because I want to make my videos as long as I want. This is my first video for that. I don't know if there's good lighting I'm using the back camera now to test out if it's better. Well, it is obviously better quality to see what it looks like better compared to a front facing camera. I don't know if my lighting's doing well. I'm just sitting here watching YouTube. I have one video left in my sub box, which is focus. It's a Deuce X Hem and uh, uh, this is the Human Revolution video from uh, John for Johnny Paula from J Pizzle One One Two Two. The guys who make my great show. So I'm just sitting here watching that. I might watch that. Maybe watch an episode of Blue. The like uh, this. I can't talk. The finale episodes of Louie and Torchwood. I'm probably gonna watch that. I have some homework to do. Where's my backpack? Here it is. I have homework to do, and I thought to celebrate the start of the vlogs that aren't just one minute anymore. Oh, by the way, sorry, just before I said that, very off topic, this game for DS, 9 hours, 9 persons, 9 doors, it is amazing. It is a fantastic game. Nintendo DS, it's usually, it's like 29 bucks now. It, uh, it wasn't that big. It, Nintendo Power gave it good reviews, so it got a bunch of people to check it out. I did too. You can barely find this anywhere. When I went to New York two months ago, yeah, two months ago now, I grabbed this from the Nintendo Store because they actually had it there. Because wherever I else went, I didn't they had didn't have it because I really wanted this. It's uh, basically they're stuck in a sunken trip and they have nine hours to get through nine or doors. And there's nine people trying to find uh, solve the puzzles to get out of the ship before it sinks. It is rated M, which is weird for a DS game. It's not that bad. There's strong language. There's violence. Supposedly there's a sexual scene in an elevator, according to people. But I haven't got there yet. But if you're looking for a new game and you have a Nintendo DS or 3DS, I'm playing it on my 3DS, pick this up. It is really good, 29 bucks. Also, I might try and do a, co a cosplay, because you saw the cosplay thing on Saturday's vlog, which went up yesterday because I was so late. Uh, cosplay for October is him, the front one, Junipi. All I need is, it looks pretty simple to do. So, that's, that's that. And, okay, throw it back to old school, Ran Pearl M. Ran Pearl M. And a purple lemonade. I'm gonna do another candy review. If you are an old school viewer, which I bet m most people aren't, you would have known I did candy reviews. Which, like, when a new gum or a candy came out, I reviewed it. And this is Mentos gum up to you. Two flavors, one pack. You decide. I thought this idea was really good. See, it, looking at it, because it's genius. Like, oop. If you look there, it says berry melon, watermelon, fresh mint. The way it works is, uh, let me just open up this package. La la la. Because it has two flavors. That's a shiny package. It has two flavors in it. Fruity and minty. I got this one. There's different flavors too. But see, here's the mint. Nothing is more difficult and therefore more precious than to be able to decide. Napoleon Bonatart. I, don't, I probably just like butchered that name. But I know it's Napoleon. Uh, the fruit ones here, I tried one of each piece. They are fairly good tasting. They're not like five gum or something because it is Mentos gum, which isn't that great of a gum. It's okay. I thought this was a genius idea because I sometimes I have a mint gum and I really want a fruity gum, but I don't have it. Sometimes I have a fruity gum and really want a mint gum, but I don't have it. But in this way, you get it two two packs. kind of find it stupid how they did it, how it flips out like that. It looks cool, but if you're carrying it, it's always like do, do, do. So I thought it would be better if they put like two rows uh, like some of the extra packs do. A choice for every moment to you today. Yeah, they taste good. Tastes fruity and good. Uh, the mint isn't up to par. It's like strong mint. is like sour or something, but it is an okay mint. So, I think this is worth checking out if you want a new gum and you want fruity and mint and instead of buying two packs. Buy one of these. They're two dollars. If I pick them up, I'd give them... What was my old scale? Out of ten candy wrappers, I'd give them a seven. It's good. Okay, so, thank you for watching the relaunch of regular length vlogs. I'm wondering if I'm going to do them from the back camera or not, because I don't know if I look good on the camera, or if I'm like, off the screen. So, thank you for watching this. Please subscribe. Goodbye. Ha. Ha. No.